Hi everyone, how are you guys doing today? Simply Natural Black here. It is Friday, July 15th. It's about 6.30 in the evening. I just got home a little while ago from work and I wanted to show you guys what I'm going to be eating today. I'm very hungry, so I tried to hurry up. Well, not hurry up, but try to get some things together so I can eat my dinner. I'm going to be having, if you can see, I'm going to be having me some sweet potatoes fries today. And here's some uh, yellow potatoes. But both of these are not mine. I'm going to eat the sweet potato fries. These are for my daughter. I might have a few of those. But yeah. And then I'm going to be having, I sauteed some shrimp here. Some extra large shrimp. But as you guys can see, the extra large shrimp is not extra large anymore. But it's okay. Yeah, those have, uh, those have uh, garlic powder, sea salt, pepper, uh, coconut oil, and some turmeric powder with cayenne pepper. And also, I have a mixture of string beans. Hope you guys can see. And it has potatoes. Potatoes in there. And there are some onions. Potatoes and onions. So yeah, you guys, that's what I'll be eating for dinner. I can't wait to eat. I actually have to cook. The potatoes have to cook a little bit more. And then I will be having my dinner. Oh, and after I'm done, well, along with my dinner, I'm going to have some good old wine. I've had this in my cabinet for hmm, maybe... I'm not sure, you guys. Maybe a little while. But I have enough here, if you can see it. Can you see? I have enough here to put in a wine glass. And I have it sitting out so I won't forget to have my wine today. But here's my wine glass. So yes, you guys, I will be having that along with my dinner. Oh, and I wanted to show you also... You guys, remember the basket I was telling you about that I have by my door? But this is the basket here. And I keep shoes in it, so when you come in, they throw their shoes in the basket instead of lining them, you know, lining them up, well, lining them up, you know, by the door over there. So, uh, yes, I like that basket sitting here like that, or I like it cat a corner, but um, you guys tell me what you think. I think it looks good, you know, a piece of natural, this is something natural, you know, a piece of uh, wood. I like natural things in my house, so yeah, this actually serves a good purpose in my home. Okay, I think that's about it. Oh, while I'm in the kitchen, you guys, I wanted to show you how I keep my cabinets and what spices that I use on my food. Like I said today, I use the cayenne pepper, turmeric. Also, I use sea salt, well, pink Himalayan salt. And I also used the turmeric and cayenne pepper. So I have a few things here. Let me turn on the light a little bit. Maybe you can see. But yeah, here's my coconut oil. And yes, as you can see, it's a little bit, it's a little bit, well, not a little bit. It's a lot melted. But this is the coconut oil I'll be using for now. This is the Butcher Boy 100% Pure Refined. If you guys can see it yeah some good coconut oil and yes you guys it is non-gmo i like that you know about the gen genetically modified ingredients organism i think one or the other and i have here some organic raw sugar that i usually put in my tea sometimes and yes here is this is the himalayan salt it's a grinder but i also like to Put this on my food for seasoning and here i have my pepper coarse ground pepper with the grinder this is my turmeric powder all of these things you guys i go to the bulk store and i buy them in bulk and then i put them inside the containers i'm going to be needing some more cayenne pepper here here's my garlic this smells so good this is my garlic powder and 
And my last one here is just, I didn't use this on anything, but this is my ground cinnamon. All these are natural, natural um, seasonings that I use on my food. And up here, you guys, I have my apple cider. Then I have some like regular vinegar back here. Here's my baking soda. Also, I have some shredded coconut and some honey. This is organic honey. And in my other cabinet, let's see. I know you guys are like, oh my gosh, she's a neat freak. Well, I am. But over here, I have all of my other condiments that I use all lined up in my mason jars. This here is like cornflakes that have not there they have not been finished yet, so that will be getting refilled after it's done. Here are some honey nut Cheerios. These are like really my daughters. I don't eat cereal like that. This is my organic oatmeal. I have here some organic raisins. And this is a nut blend, you guys, for energy and protein. We have walnuts, almonds, pecans, we have prunes in here, raisins. And if you can see, it's pumpkin seeds in there. And then down here below, I keep sometimes bananas in here. Keep them fresh longer. I actually have beans, red beans in here in this big, large one with a little bit of spaghetti left over. Here is my homemade, this is homemade, um, what do you call it, guys? This is pancake mix. And I have some blueberries hydrogenated blueberries real blue real blueberries but they they are dried blueberries and i mix them into the mixture and then you guys oh sorry for the noise somebody's mowing their grass but yes here is my peanut butter natural peanut butter i have some cocoa powder here let's see my jasmine rice organic brown jasmine rice and i have this is a mixture you guys this is uh what is this Oh, this is flaxseed and chia seeds. That's funny. I don't even remember what was in there. And then I have here my, I finally found this at Whole Foods. This is the Bob's Red Mill baking soda. Um, I think this is better than what I was using. I was buying just basically an off brand of the, uh, an off brand of the Arm & Hammer baking soda, but I think this brand, Bob's Red Mill, he's been around for a long time, and uh, it's gluten free, as you can see here. I love gluten free things, so yes, that was a good buy, and I think it was like three dollars. Yes. Oh, sorry, you guys, it's so noisy. Okay, and down here below, here are some. Hair, skin, and nail vitamins. These, my daughter takes these. I don't use these. I feel like if you eat enough fruits and vegetables, you don't need to take any extra uh, pills. And I have, oh gosh, y'all, it's so noisy. Hold on one second. Let me close this window. Okay, maybe that's a little bit better, hopefully. Okay, and I actually over here, I just have a couple of cans, a couple of cans of tuna some soup here, some uh, thing of baked beans. I have a bottle of wine here. Oh, you, you guys, I bought this a little while ago, but this is some, this is organic, some organic wine. It's by, made by organic grapes. And I think you pronounce this, Shamango, Shamango. And this is from Argentina. So yes, I'm gonna be enjoying this one day with some dinner. And also, you guys, let's see here. When I traveled to the Amish country, I bought some wine from this company here. As you can see, it has a little horse on it. But yes, you guys, this is, this is dandelion wine. This is very good and you only can buy it in the Amish country. I've never, I never was able to purchase it anywhere else. But yes, it only cost me like uh, $10. And it's really, really good. I've had it before. Um, also, I just have here some Trader Joe's bacon, bacon powder. That's aluminum free and double acting. Uh, here's one of my K cups where I will be getting rid of because 
I don't want to use the, my Keurig anymore for the simple fact I don't think it's good for, for the earth because you have to dispose of the little pay cups. I like recycling. You can recycle some of them, but some of the coffee ones you can't recycle for the simple fact they still have coffee grinds in them. So I feel like it's not serving a purpose. So I'm going to be uh, selling my Keurig. It's really nice too. Uh, also here I have some Italian dressing and some organic mayo. Organic mayo here. And some over here I just have some uh, wheat crackers and a couple of little treats here these are actually sold at Costco's hopefully you guys can see those and the brand is Nomini's oh no Noni's they're thin addictive and they're really good there's like a piece of toast like a wheat toast and they have uh, they have nuts in them. I know for sure they have pistachios in there and some other uh, fine nuts that are good for you. But yes, you guys, that's about it. I just wanted to show you what was in my cabinets today and everything and how I organize it. I'm going to let that go by because that is driving me crazy. Whew. I actually thought somebody was getting their yard cut, but it's actually me getting my yard cut. The landscapers are here, and I'm so sorry, you guys. I didn't know they were coming at this time of day. But yes, this is, like I said, all the spices and things that I use when I cook, and I'm going to be letting you guys go because guess what? I need to eat my dinner. I'm like, actually, I'm not starving, but I am hungry because I've been at work all day, and all I had this morning was a smoothie, and for lunch, I had a banana and some blueberries. And I had snacked on a little bit of nuts. But yeah, I'm going to end this video. And I hope you guys like the video today. If you like it, you know what to do. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe. And you guys, I really love your comments that you've been leaving and everything. So have a wonderful evening. And I will see you guys next week on Monday. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.